Most people don't need a laptop like the Dell XPS 15. The average person spends closer to half as much as this $1,500 laptop. And even if it was in their budget, most people just don't need a discrete graphics card, 6-core processor, 16 gigabytes of RAM, and a larger 15-inch screen. But what if you need that? What if you're a video editor, or programmer, or designer, or architect, or music producer? You need a laptop that can handle the heavy workload you use every day. Or perhaps you just want to know your laptop can play games as well as it can work. While the XPS 13 was refreshed earlier this year with a new color option and a redesigned thermal solution, the XPS 15's design remains unchanged. That's not an entirely bad thing, though. The XPS 15 feels more like a chameleon that blends in with its environment, instead of a flashy new toy. When closed, or when viewed from the back, the silver aluminum finish of the Dell XPS 15 is elegant and classy. It might not feel quite as modern chic as a Surface or Mac, but it wouldn't look out of place in a coffee shop or photography studio, either. Open it up, and you'll be greeted by black polycarbon palm rests and a keyboard that look appropriate sitting next to a ThinkPad or Inspiron. The XPS 15 always looks like it belongs, no matter where you use it. The ultra-thin bezels still look great and keep the XPS 15's profile sleek, but they're not as unique as they once were. In fact, the XPS 15's bezels are bested by the 91% screen-to-body ratio of the Huawei MateBook X Pro. Though it's no longer cutting edge, the XPS 15's small footprint remains impressive. Rather than make the thinnest or lightest 15-inch laptop, Dell has instead continued to focus on rigidity and durability. It's a full pound heavier than the 15-inch MacBook Pro and 1.6 pounds more than the ultralight LG Gram. At its thickest, 0.7 inches, it's thicker than even the razor blade, though the hinge shape allows for maximum efficiency. It's also built like a tank. It takes two hands to pry its stiff hinge open, but that means you'll have to try hard to find any flex or bending in the chassis or lid. Though can't be said for laptops like the LG Gram, which shoot for portability above all else. While Dell has pulled back the parts options on the XPS 13, there's more options on the XPS 15. With two USB-A ports, a Thunderbolt 3, four lanes of C, HDMI, and a full-size SD card slot, the XPS 15 proves itself to be made for the messy, incongruent nature of business. Dell has smartly realized that limited connectivity might suffice for casual usage, but more options are needed when it's time to get real work done.